Welcome to Billy Review Stuff, where I review stuff. Today, we're looking at the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles inspired by the 1990 movie Ninja Elite series, Leo in Disguise. Because we all remember when Leo dressed up in a, a trench coat and hat and went to go watch Critters and was like, ah, into the sky after uh, Casey Jones beat the crap out of him and tossed him in a trash can, right? Oh, wait. No, that didn't happen. This is not based on anything with the movie. I don't get it, Playmates. Why? Just make the bandana red. But really, I'm also reviewing the Vivitar Creator Series Full Color Full Spectrum Studio Light Pocket. And uh, this thing was $39.99 at Walmart. And I have it off to the, the side over here at 50%. I'm going to turn, over my, uh, turn off my overhead light, and this is at 50% right there, and it has an aluminum body, which is pretty neat. Uh, let's see here, let's get all the way to 100%. Yeah, this is a 100% light. That is bright as crap. That is, this is a super bright light. Uh, so far, I am digging it. Uh, I've had it charging for like the past, whoo, I'd say 20 minutes, and it's almost at a full charge. And uh, I don't, let's see here, does it say how long it's supposed to... Last on a charge on here, uh, it says, it says 4,000 uh, milliamp uh, battery capacity, so that should be for a, a pretty long time, and uh, it has different color modes, which I'm excited about for all my photography and stuff, and uh, videos and everything. Oh, yeah, great. Party mode. Let's see. There we go. Let's get that back to... Yeah, it should be about right right there. Okay. Uh, back on... Oh. It also has two screw holes for attaching to uh, the, was it, uh, th three, three, one, eight, three, three quarter? I can't remember the mount size. Uh, nuts. But it has two mounts on there, so you can mount it up, mount it down, and it came with another little, this is a, no, that's actually, it's probably like a pop metal thing still, but it feels, feels cold to the touch, so it has like a little metal right there, so... So far, I, I feel like it was worth $39.99, but on to uh, the toys. So, he has a cloth coat, which is really why I wanted him, because I want to take, and when I finally get Alf in, whenever that finally happens, because uh, I've been waiting on Big Bad Toy Store for a long time, and I don't have any targets in my area anymore. Uh, let's see if he can come up. Let's see here. Oh. So, I thought this hat was going to be, like, a piece of not great felt or something like that. Um, it turns out is a flocked, flocked piece of plastic. I mean, like it does have where like this is, this flocking is, is a different color, but yeah, that's just a, it is a flocked hat. I mean, it, it looks grody. I mean, like it should, but uh, yeah, surprise. And here we have uh, Leo in his go into the movie's trench coat. Yeah, I'll, I'll let it go. I'll let it go. I, I mean, like, it's neat. They they also have a Michelangelo doing it. So I'm like, are they going to put out every turtle but uh, Raphael? Is there a rights issue where they can't exactly put uh, put uh, old Raphael in a, in a coat? Because uh, NECA has where they're doing the movie stuff. And this has where it says it's inspired by. So maybe that's it. Okay. So you have a, a, a fairly decently stitched. Like one twelfth scale coat. It's got buttons on there and everything. I, I think this might be worth worth most of the $20 cost for the soft goods. And it has where it Velcro's on there. So soft good review. This was worth it. This, I don't know. Here, let me add a, another light here because this this Vivar is great. I just wrong way here. Come on. There we go. It just looks a little dark. Unplug it. There we go. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. I definitely might have to pick up another one of these lights. I, I like it. Um, I like the fact that I don't have a bunch of wires everywhere right now. So. Still, still pro of our light, but uh, the Playmates toy mold, it has a ball joint at the head, 
Um, let's see here. His arms. He's got a ton of articulation. Oh, let's see here. Come on. Arms go up that high. He has bicep. He has the uh, double hinge elbow. Um, let's see here. What does he got? He has swivel at the wrist. Yeah, I need another light on here. You know, next paycheck, probably going to pick up another one of these things. There we go. That's a bit better. Yeah. Swivel at the wrist. Does it hinge back and forth at all? I don't I don't think so. What's going on there? It's hidden behind this. Whatever. Does it? Let me get this closer to me. He's got something going on there. Oh, yeah. It's hidden behind his wrist wrap, but he does have where it like hinges at the wrist. So he's got that going for him. And then he has articulated fingers, which are kind of cool. They they don't they don't look great, but uh oh there. Yeah, they don't look great, but they work. They don't look bad, they don't look great. Okay, let's see what kind of articulation we have with this turtle torso here. Okay, so he has an upper chest ball joint there. It attaches the shell. Okay. All right. Well, that makes sense. Normal. What is that? Is that a... Okay, so that's a, that's a ball joint at the top of the leg. Okay. Turn that there. Ball joint at the top of the leg. Swivel at the top of the hip. Double knee joint. Does have he's got a very good ankle. The ankles all over the place. Does he have? Oh, does he not have? No, he has where you can you can twist the foot. It just doesn't have where it's like a a rocker exactly. Since it goes straight down, it seems like that's something they could update it. I think. And then he has he has a. Turtle toe articulation. So, eh. His eyes are a little wonky looking. Just a little. Feels like they're... No. No, maybe it's just me. One's a little higher than the other. Eh. And then he has his swords. Uh, rubbery. Fine. Do they fit into his sheath easy? Looks like they do. One needs to be heated up a little bit because it's wonky looking. And boom. I think he's a perfectly serviceable Leonardo. Uh, I would have preferred Raphael. I, I like Raphael better. Uh, and let's see how this hat fits. Let's see here. The front. I guess you see the front. Yeah. The, the hat fits. It's supposed to go that way. It's supposed to go this way. Yeah, yeah. Bill Ford. Yeah, hat fits. It, it does what it's supposed to. Does it look great? I don't know. For 20 bucks, you can't really complain. If if this is your jam, go for it. If you need a coat, uh, definitely go for it. That's the, the, the Playmates Leo in disguise. So, like, share, subscribe. Uh... I'll see you next time, and I'll probably going to heavily edit this video.